It was a beautiful day yesterday uh, for sure to wrap up the Labor Day weekend and the great weather continues as we uh, head back to school or back to work this morning. We're starting off with temperatures in the 50s across the area. In fact, temperatures running a good 10 degrees cooler than normal, even though we are now into meteorological fall and Labor Day representing the end of summer, or at least unofficially. Our normal low temperature is 65 degrees. We're going to be in the mid 50s for the next couple of mornings before we start to see a little bit of a warm up as we head into the weekend, at which point we'll start to talk about the chance of rain, which will we'll start to give you an idea of what to expect here in just a couple of minutes. But starting off your Tuesday morning with a live view in Bethlehem where all is calm. It's a really nice morning. There is a little bit of crispness in the air just because of the fact that the air that we have moving in this morning is not just cool, but it's also dry. Some of the driest air that we've had since late April. So those low 60s along the shore, in fact, those upper 50s from South Jersey all the way up into the Lehigh Valley do have that really dry feel that is that indication of the changing season as we start to get some of that more fall like air moving in from the north. Have a look at these temperatures up towards Doylestown where temperatures are at 53 degrees. We're right around 50 in Allentown in Philadelphia currently right around 59 degrees. So those temperatures, those Dew points, which is the driver of our comfort level, which is represent how much moisture is in the atmosphere, all is a little bit lower than normal, and that gives us those clear skies that we're waking up to this morning that will ultimately give us a lot of sunshine as we go throughout the day today. But all of those cooler uh, cooler temperatures are moving in from the north because of a high pressure system out towards our west. So it will continue to pump in that cooler and drier air for us as we go through the next couple of days before that warm up will lead us into the second half of the week and the weekend for your Tuesday though. Look at this. I mean, clear skies, plenty of sunshine today. Temperatures into the low and mid 70s. Philadelphia peaks probably a little bit closer to the mid upper 70s. And then tonight we'll see a few passing clouds to the south. Otherwise, mostly clear skies. The little bit of wind that we have across the area this morning will die down, allowing for a little bit more efficient cooling tonight. We could even see somewhat cooler temperatures tomorrow morning than what we're waking up to this morning into your Wednesday afternoon. A, a lot more of the same than what we'll see today. Highs in the upper 70s to near 80 degrees under mostly sunny conditions. And then we got to talk about that chance of rain right now. It looks like Friday afternoon could see just a couple of light showers with more widespread showers into the day on Saturday and then Sunday. Those showers should be starting to move out. It's actually coming from two different weather makers. One will be a coastal low pressure system. Another cold front sweeping in from the west. It'll be the coastal low that throws us the chance of rain as we go through the day on Friday. That low looks to clear up to the north and east before the cold front sweeps in from the west to keep the chance of rain around as we go into the first half of our weekend. Depending on how quickly that cold front moves through will ultimately determine when the rain clears out. But right now it looks like some showers could linger into early Sunday morning. No rain, hardly any clouds in the sky today, though. High temperatures up around 76 degrees. Just a great looking day across the area. Let me show you how it all comes together in the next weather set day forecast. I mentioned a gradual warming for those low temperatures. Those daytime highs gradually warm too. back up to 79 degrees on Wednesday, 80 degrees on Thursday. We'll see high temperatures there in the upper 70s and lower 80s into Friday. But remember that small chance of rain returns Friday afternoon, more likely seeing showers across the area on Saturday and then clearing and getting back to sunshine and highs in the 70s as we go into early next week.